I'm Priscilla, one of the test drivers on the Google Self-Driving Car Project. Our team is responsible for keeping the cars and other people safe while on the road, and for providing feedback on how they perform in the real world. A big part of our job is to go out into the world and uncover all the potential scenarios that a car might encounter. Then we help the engineers teach the car how to best navigate each one. Here are some examples of situations that we regularly encounter on the streets of Mountain View, California. We've taught the vehicle to recognize and navigate through construction zones. Our sensors spot the orange signs and cones early to alert the car of the lane blockage ahead, and we can change lanes safely. You'll also notice the vehicle typically moves to keep a safe distance away from large obstacles, like this truck stopped on the side of the road. Now we're approaching a railroad crossing, which requires special care. Notice the red fence and railroad sign that appears to the computer as we approach the intersection. This means that we'll wait until the tracks are clear of other vehicles before proceeding. Our cars treat cyclists as a special category of moving object. Watch in this example, when the cyclist holds up his arm, our software detects the hand signal and predicts his movement into our lane. The car knows to continue yielding to the cyclist passing by, even when he changes his mind, multiple times. So now what you'll see is our vehicle at a busy intersection. Here the cars are represented by pink boxes, and the cyclists and pedestrians are the red and yellow boxes. Now notice the boxes moving past us. It's the cyclists and pedestrians' turn to go. The red and green fences indicate that the car will stop and wait until the path is clear. We even detect the cyclist approaching from behind and wait until they've passed. Once the cyclist has gone by, the vehicle determines that it's safe to turn. We still have more work to do, but it's fun to see how many situations we can now handle smoothly and naturally. See you on the road.